with my followers and make sure I'm calling by the right name. Hey Kay, what's going on sis? Hey Dr. Sean, happy Monday. Hey Britt, what's going on? Good morning. Thank you for joining in. I know you guys are at work this Monday morning, so <laughs> hey. I know you guys are at work. How's your Monday going so far? Are you guys enjoying it as much as I am? <laughs> Um, and it's a start to a new week and so I just want to help you get your week off to a great start so I just want to share some things with you and um, take this with you and throughout your day thank you Norman thanks for joining so thank you guys for the hearts um, it is oh oh yeah that's Dr. Sean oh quick um, shout out to Dr. Sean she is um, a new follower uh, friend that I have she is a dentist you guys she is amazing a doctor um, she's accomplished a lot from what I can see so far from her social media so I would encourage you to follow her um, she's a great spirit and I think you guys would um, really like to engage with her hey Rico so that's dr. Sean you're welcome <laughs> um, so I can't wait to watch some more of your scopes and see how you do um, so one last thing and other stuff um, I would encourage you to also share this um, broadcast with your followers hey Keezy Coleman um, share this with your followers just hit what to the left and share and this will get the message out a lot quicker and help me to reach my goal I'm almost up to 100,000 hearts so I am looking forward to getting some more friends all right so I'm gonna just get right into it um hey Shello um, and Keezy hey it's Monday so I'm here to encourage you guys thank you for sharing on Twitter Stephanie and thank you for inviting followers all right Brittany um, okay so traveler um, I don't know if is that a song or something I'm not sure but anyways I'm gonna get in because I don't like to waste time um, so hey Raphael so my name is Camille Davis I am from Virginia and I am here to encourage enlighten and inspire um, each and every person that I come in contact with that is my personal mission um, I love to do that with actual tangible things that you can use in your life um, that will reach your spirit and help you to take action in the real world hey Brazil nice um, so today I am introducing and kicking off the 12 days of Camille. I know y'all like, what the heck is that? Well, uh, you know the 12 days of Christmas, right? Every day there's a different gift. Well, I'm doing 12 days of Christmas. There's officially 12 days, you guys, 12 days till Christmas. So, um, I'm doing 12 days of Camille. So every day is my goal to get on Periscope and do some, um, do a broadcast and share something with you guys as a gift. Um, and I'm most likely will scope twice a day. The morning is going to be my encouragement, um, encouragement, personal growth scopes. And then in the evening, I'm going to do my beauty scopes. <laughs> and I know, Crystal. Dr. Sean, you should do it too. So I'm going to encourage you guys, if you have a business, if you have something that you're putting out there, um, you need music advice. Okay. Um, <laughs> um, sorry, I'm trying to follow you, Keezy. Um, I don't have any music advice, but what I would encourage you to do is to find a mentor who does. That is always my um, suggestion. One is a mentor, and two, do your research. Um, so I would like to find, you know, um, connect with you on another level. But anyway, so get back to 12 days. So today I'm kicking off the 12 days of Camille. Um, hey, Day Solo. I'm kicking off the 12 days of Camille by giving you a couple of gifts that I've learned um, just over this past week and weekend. Um, so I learned a lot about fear this weekend. Um, and so fear, what most people don't realize about fear, you think it's a negative um, emotion. Most people associate it with a negative emotion. So if you think back to a situation where you were like, I really don't want to do that, like dogs, for example. Oh my gosh, you used to be so afraid of big dogs. Um, and what that is, is actually energy. Our body is made up of energy and vibrations. So when you're feeling this feeling, you may feel it. Some people feel it in the pit of their stomach. Some people feel it in their throat. Um, so you want to locate where you're feeling this tension when you come upon a situation that makes you nervous. Um, and then you identify, you close your eyes, you can even see if it has a color, you can name it and see what it is. And then you want to associate it exactly with what 
what that feeling is so you can identify it because most of the time you're actually excited about something um, or you're uncertain about something. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Sean. Um, so you're excited about something and you just need a little bit of help. Hey, sweet Chaco. So I'm sorry, I, I'm so random with that. But anyways, um, so you just want to take it and transform it and rename it and use it as fuel to motivate you towards something because usually that's a signal that God wants you to um, move forward and to carry out something great. So don't look at it as something negative. Think about it as something that's going to propel you into your greatness, okay? Hey, peace, strong. So um, so that is my tip about fear. Um, and over the weekend, I shared that I went to uh, last week. Thank you. Yeah, pump some hearts, you guys. Dr. Sean, she's gonna she's gonna be the winner with these hearts today. I tell you, um, <laughs> thank you. So um, I went to New York, and I've never been in New York City. I've been in the upstate, but never in the actual city. So I was thinking, you know, I would take public transportation to get there. Well, you guys, guess who drove there? Yes, me. I was like, oh my gosh, I want to drive in Manhattan, but I did it, and um, I thought it was gonna be crazy because you see them like the the, the taxis and everything, and like all the traffic. I'm like, no, I won't do, it. I won't do it. But you know what? We ended up going at night. God made a way, and then by the time I got out there, it was actually so beautiful. The traffic was like not even bad. I felt like I was driving in Richmond, like literally, it was not that bad. And so sometimes we outthink. Yeah, sometimes we outthink ourselves and think that the negative situation is going to happen. When you think positive, positive things happen, right? So um, so that's my story. <laughs> Thanks for listening, Keezy. And um, I definitely want to find out a little bit more about you, but I want to share this. So the scripture of the day that I'm giving you today for the 12 days of Camille it comes from 2 Timothy. And maybe somebody can type this in the box. 2 Timothy 1, 7. Exactly. Think positive. Hey, Maya. Um, so that says, God has not given us the spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. Okay. Thank you. So, um, yes, yeah, so that is your scripture. So keep repeating that to yourself over and over again. Anytime you come up on a situation where you feel, hey, AJ, hi. Um, anytime you come in a situation where you feel, um, afraid and you just say, God hasn't given us the spirit of fear. <laughs> exactly. Amen. So um, that is the scripture. Now I have um, two challenges for you guys. One, I have posted the scripture of the day on my Instagram and on my Facebook page. So I would like you to go and follow me um, at the underscore real underscore Camille on Instagram, or you can just type in my name, Camille Davis, and you'll see that scripture of the day. I put a post of um, the picture actually me in Manhattan. So just take it. You can either screenshot it or you can do your own no fear post and just um, tag me in it and hashtag no fear allowed 2016 okay um and then that will be i'll do for uh the winner for tomorrow to see who did their um to see who did their post so test tag me no fear allowed exactly no fear allowed 2016 that's the campaign um okay and then you can also go on to um the website which is the book club and there's a book no fear allowed by laura herring she is one of my mentors mentors um she is the founder of spanx I'm sorry, not founder. She's one of the CEOs of Spanx, and she also um, has a multi-million dollar industry and business, and so that is um, the book that we're going to be kicking off for the new year, so I think, Dr. Sean, you may enjoy that. So go on to the website, and it's also in my bio, and that's right, scumbag. <laughs> that's a funny name. So, um, so you guys, I would love for you to do your post and let me know what thing that you have a fear of so we can conquer it together in 2016. I want to encourage you and check and inspire you and just help you to overcome those fears and those obstacles because God hasn't given us the spirit of fear. That's right. Amen. I am face off. Let me make sure I'm following you. So there we go. All right. So tomorrow I will be back again because one of my fears is doing scopes every day at the same time every day. Oh my gosh. Like my life is so unpredictable as an entrepreneur. But I'm going to do it, you guys. I'm I am going to do it. Hi, G. Smith. So come back tomorrow, and we'll do you another gift so you get to see. Um, oh, and I did a song for you guys. So you get to watch the video, the song, and the scripture of the day. So I'll give you three things today. Three things, okay? So go on my Facebook and go on my Instagram. Check them out. Um, the songs are on the Facebook page. You listen to those songs, and you're going to just have a rocking day. Love you guys. <laughs> Thank you. Absolutely. 
Oh, my Facebook is Camille Davis. Oh, thank you, Shello. I'm glad you enjoyed it. You have to let me know where you're from and we have to become Facebook buddies. <laughs> yes, it's just Camille Davis. And I think I friended you, Dr. Sean. So, um, yeah, so go ahead and check it out. All right, you too. Have a blessed day. Love you guys. Come back for the 11th day of Camille tomorrow. Mm-hmm. <laughs>